Hey guys, welcome to a brand new Resident Evil video. Today we're going to be talking about Resident Evil Reverse and where it's at. So unfortunately, it did get delayed until most likely the end of summer. I just want to preface this that summer starts June 21st and it ends in September 22nd. So we have a rest or a, we have a pretty good estimate uh of our timeline when it could be released um unfortunately it was revealed way too early and it was good that they delayed it which um that is uh the part where it hurts the most it they delayed it and well i hope they can take this opportunity to add more content to it while we wait you know resident evil 8 had a very smooth launch it was really good that they delayed it we still have resident evil 8 which it honestly has so much content to play around with while we wait for Resident Evil Reverse. I hope Resident Evil Reverse is much more enjoyable than what we had back in Resident Evil 3 in that multiplayer. Not that it was bad by any means, but it wasn't as what I expected. I really am excited for Resident Evil Reverse. I am not going to have my hopes up high, but it's okay to think positive about it i mean what i've seen with resident evil 8 i'm just blown away resident evil 8 is my favorite resident evil yet um you know i'm, I'm not gonna lie if they take the same elements from this game and add into a multiplayer spin-off that'd be pretty cool and um i mean resident evil reverse seems very promising it looks really nice and the fact that it's going to be free can tell a lot you know i see it with the beta gameplay that was shown, not a lot of people were complaining. It seems like an enjoyable, all around, just fun multiplayer experience. If you're there to, you know, spend hella hours on the game, I wouldn't really get your hopes up, but if you're just there to play an hour or two for the casual experience, then you're in the right mindset. But other than that, guys, that's all I really wanted to talk about in today's video. I hope you guys definitely did enjoy. I didn't edit too much in this video. I do have a bigger video coming out tomorrow, which I'm going to stay up and edit. I'm going to be talking about the sad fate of Ethan Winters in Resident Evil 8. Uh, there's going to be spoilers in that video, so I recommend not watching if you haven't finished the game. Other than that, guys, I will catch you guys in the next video. Peace out, guys.